Psalm 1, verse 3. And he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water, that bringeth forth his fruit in his season. His leaf also shall not wither, and whatsoever he doeth shall prosper. He shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water, that bringeth forth his fruit in his season. I like that. What is it that I really like about this? I like the fact that the scriptures make it very clear that we are not year-round fruit-bearing trees. Yeah, 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 you got that? Yes. Guess what? We will bear fruit in our season. It's important to know this. The fact that there is no fruit on your tree right now, the tree of your life, does not mean you are not blessed, does not mean you are not planted, does not mean you are not in God's will. It likely just means it's not that season. Seasons come and seasons go. And unfortunately, we tend to assess our lives based on all the wonderful things that are happening or not happening. But it will not always be the season for the fruit to be bearing and getting ripe on your tree. Sometimes it will only be leaves. Sometimes it will now be time for blossom and we still have to wait. And the blossoms have to fall off before we get fruits. But guess what? At the end of the day, you're still blessed. The verse says his leaf shall not wither and whatsoever he does prospers. So you're prospering, but it's not the season of your fruit. It means then that when I prosper, it is not only when everything is going great and, 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 and you know, it's more than I can contain, and, but I'm still prospering when some things are not present. Yes, because there are seasons in our life. And there are some persons who, unfortunately, they met you in the season, or probably we could call it your, your off season. They met you in the time when the fruits aren't there. And they judge you and assess you based on that. And they think you are not all that because they are not seeing the fruits. But you know better the time for your fruits to come forth will come around again. Not every season is mango season or guinep season or apple season. Whatever it is, it also means that when my fruits are out, yours may not be. Because we're not necessarily the same tree. So therefore, it may be that your season when you are bearing fruit is my season when I am being rejuvenated to bear fruits again. But that's why we are all in one body. So that when you're bearing fruit, we all benefit. And when I'm bearing fruit, we all benefit. But we are not all bearing fruit at the same time. So, stay in God and have confidence. Don't get distressed because you're not bearing year round. You need some time to rejuvenate. You need some time to recalibrate, you need some time to get back to the fullness so that there can be a build-up to cause you to have great fruit. 
So bear your fruit in your season. And when it's your off season, build up, get strong, get ready for fruit bearing season is coming again. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. And for more, join us at 9 a.m. on Sunday mornings at 10 Union Square, Crossroads. If you can't be there in person, join us virtually via Facebook Live.